to be teachable. There's four steps to the teachability index, and the first is unconsciously incompetent. This is when you don't know what you don't know. You don't realize how ignorant you really are. Step number two, you become consciously incompetent. This is when you realize like, wow, I'm not the sharpest knife in the drawer. But here's the bigger question. What are you going to do about it? And step number three, this is when you become consciously competent. But this is when pride creeps in. You start to feel like you're omniscient. And we know that there's only one omniscient one, and that's God. And step number four, where you want to be, is unconsciously competent. This is when you don't know how much you know, and therefore you remain teachable. Here's three reasons why you got to remain teachable. Number one, if you're unteachable, well, guess what? You're unreachable. Number two, when you're unteachable, you remove yourself from people, places, and things that challenge you to be better. And number three, you got to develop a gangster mindset, a mind that truly understands that acquiring wisdom and knowledge puts you in the very best position for success. Hey, my friend, you were born to be great. Follow me on social media at Mark Baxter, Problem Solving Therapist, M-A-R-C-B-A-X-T-E-R. And on Instagram, I'm at Mark Inspires, M-A-R-C-I-N-S-P-I-R-E-S. Never forget, my friend, the great mind is the mind that can simplify all things. So get out here on this beautiful Saturday, spread love, no excuses, and whatever you do, remain teachable. Your life depends on it, and be great while you're at it.